But first, let's answer a couple of questions while they're saying. The third graders at Christ the King School in Chicago, Illinois, want to know what group of animals has been most threatened by the loss of wetlands? Rob, can you help them out? Well, it's lots of animals that live specifically in these wetlands, and they really are sensitive to them. So right here in, Br in British Columbia, right here in Boundary Bay, ones like the great blue heron that nest around here, they really are dependent on this wetland. This is where they catch fish, and where they really are dependent on having this wetland. Unfortunately, it's set aside and protected for them. So some of them are specific to these wetlands, and they really need to have these special places. Well, great. And we also would like to give a shout out to our students out in uh, watching in Panama. What birds do we have here that have spent winters in Panama? Well, I'm glad you asked that, Sarah. This is really, a, really an important uh, feature of Boundary Bay. Boundary Bay is on the migra migratory route for shorebirds migrating from the breeding grounds up in Alaska to places like Panama. And we have birds coming through here, hundreds of thousands of them in the spring and in the fall, the western sandpiper in particular, that will land here and refuel, feeding on all those little invertebrates that we talked about. And they'll use that as fuel and fly all the way down to Panama and we know that because we've been down to Panama and we put bands on the birds and we've seen them right here on Boundary Bay. So we know they're connected. Wow. 